Now that you got the basic building blocks in place, let's make sure that your agents are efficient day after day. Views are where your agents will spend most of their time, so it's critically important that they've set up in a way that actually reflects their workflow. Views could be thought of as folders of tickets, each with their own set of filters. It's very common for an admin to create views for different teams or about different types of requests, like one for technical questions or another for billing issues. Another option might be creating views based on the customer who submitted the ticket, especially if you're supporting any VIP accounts. Once you've got the right collection of tickets, don't forget to sort the view so that most important tickets are at the top, perhaps prioritizing the oldest tickets first. A couple of valuable columns to include with your views are the time remaining until the next SLA breach or even the predicted customer satisfaction. By sharing these views with your agents, you can ensure that everyone is working from the same perspective instead of leaving it up to each agent's own interpretation. Next, we'll talk about using macros to reply to tickets efficiently. Macros can be applied with a click of a button to provide the customer with a thorough and error-free response. And they're more than just canned replies to your FAQs. They can include placeholders like the customer's name and can update other ticket properties too, like the type, group, and status. As you build out a library of macros, we recommend nesting them into categories so it's easy for anyone to find the template they need. You can even use macros to create a better internal escalations from one agent group to another. For example, let's say that we're escalating a ticket from our support team to a developer so they can investigate a bug. If our developers always need a couple of pieces of information before they can begin their work, we can list them as an internal comment in a macro that's easy for an agent to complete before escalating the ticket. This ensures that the developer has what they need from the start and can get right to work. Lastly, let's think about what other tools your agents use on a daily basis. Whether that be a CRM, a different shipping platform, or maybe even a product database. Embed all of that information right at their fingertips by installing apps from our marketplace. You'll find nearly a thousand options that can be added right into the ticket interface so your agents don't have to flip from one tab to another over and over. By combining the features we've covered here, you'll be setting your agents up for success.